Welcome back, friends. I'm Storm Team 10 meteorologist Jeff Hanna, which had a few showers today up towards the highland southern Shenandoah. For the most part, it's pretty quiet right now, maybe a sprinkle or two around. As we take a look, though, at future tracker, these little itty bitty sprinkles and rain showers west are going to change phase over to snow showers tonight. We are looking at a better chance for some snow showers as soon as maybe 4 or 5 a.m. on Wednesday. And then look at this by 7, 8 o'clock in the morning on Wednesday. We may have a few flurries and or light snow showers here in our neck of the woods, maybe towards the New River Valley, towards the highlands. I don't think anything's really going to accumulate. The accumulating sh uh, snow should stay into West Virginia, but we could see some snowflakes here very late tonight, especially into tomorrow morning. So they put on Wednesday a little more cloud cover west, more sunshine to the east. I think you're mostly sunny tomorrow, Lynchburg and south side. I think you're partly sunny as you head towards the highlands and also into the NRV with more clouds early in the day and more sun later on. Now as we head into tomorrow night, still upslope snow showers will be around in West Virginia. Otherwise we here will be partly cloudy and then on Thursday we are looking at a mostly sunny sky pretty much from sun up until sundown and then all eyes of course turn to the weekend and we're watching a low pressure system coming at us from the southwest moving to the north into the east. Right now the storm is in Mexico, so it has to go through Texas eventually in the Gulf Coast state. So a lot of details to iron out here over the next couple of days, but uh, the confidence is growing that we will have at least some snow here this weekend as the moisture will move in from the south. Cold air is going to try to retreat to the north on Sunday, and that means probably the precipitation likely does not stay all snow for the duration of this event. I think it's probably going to start off of snow. We're going to have several hours worth of snow from the looks of things right now, but by Sunday it would not at all surprise me if a mix starts to kind of mix in with uh, the snow. So our confidence meter right now, we're going to put it on the moderate side uh, that a winter storm is indeed headed our direction. We feel pretty confident that that is going to happen. It's just a matter of how much we get. Track and timing, we feel fairly confident in that right now. I can tell you I'm more confident with the timing than I am with the track. Uh, precipitation type, not as confident. We think we're going to get some snow, but we also think on Sunday we could also have some sleet and perhaps even freezing rain mixing in. Local impacts, I do think at this point, this is going to be an impactful storm for southwest and central Virginia. 53 right now, Hot Springs 55 with Phil 62, Roanoke 61 in Danville. Winds right now anywhere between roughly 5 and 20 miles per hour. Winds not as strong east, they are stronger into the mountains, and that's going to be the ongoing trend here as we go over the next uh, couple of days. Wind advisories go into effect at 11 p.m. tonight for areas shaded in brown. High wind warnings go into effect at the same time frame for these areas shaded in gold. Lynchburg south side, you're going to be windy, but you're not in an advisory or a warning right now. That will be all west of you. Wind speeds really from 7 a.m. tomorrow through 7 p.m. tomorrow. We're looking at them anywhere between 20 and 30 miles per hour sustained with some gusts perhaps up to 40 if not 50 miles per hour. Wind chills tomorrow morning going to feel like the teens and 20s in most spots and look at Thursday morning. Thursday morning is just going to be brutally cold as most everybody out towards the mountains going to feel more like the single digits could feel like 11 in Roanoke likely going to feel like the teens in Lynchburg and Southside. It is going to feel every bit like winter here for about the next week or so. 30 Six on Thursday, Friday, 40. It looks like Thursday and Friday were dry. Snow looks to form here on Saturday, maybe changing over to a little bit of a mix on Sunday. It looks like Monday and Tuesday will be dry, but highs then still only in the low to mid 40s. We should see a little more sun by early next week again.